Hi everybody, I'm Dr. Rupe. Welcome to another video. Today we are going to be doing something a little bit different. We are going to be doing a redstone tutorial. And we are going to be building like an automatic, like, uh, you know what you see at like shop as shopping centres where you walk up to a door and the door magically opens. We're going to have, we're going to build something like that and the, I didn't build it myself. I didn't build it myself. I got a video I got it from a video I saw I put the link to the video in the description but I will quickly show off the video here on what we have to do and then we will show you how to build it so first of all we have to have these frost walker boots on and if you don't know what these frost walker boots are they basically makes it so you can walk about walk across water um, without falling in the water and then eventually the water will start going away so, as you can see, the water blocks are breaking, which is very, very cool. Let's just quickly toggle downfall so we don't get any rain lagging out my computer. I should stop in a second. So, I'll quickly show you this here. I've got my boots on. So, you walk up to this door and the door opens, which is very, very cool. And then eventually, as you walk backwards, the door should shut itself yes see there there and I've got a set one behind here on how the redstone works but today we are going to be showing you how to build it so what you're going to need is you're going to need four redstone if you're building this in survival I'm not but you're going to need four redstone two redstone torches a repeater one sticky piston one block of redstone one glowstone a sticky piston a water bucket and some stone bricks I think is that all is that everything I think it is yes that is everything so first of all you got to start off you got to dig a block of your choice and you got to dig two blocks down and place a redstone torch and then fill in the top and then you have to get an iron door out which I didn't have on me that was the extra item that you needed and then you're gonna have to place it sideways like this so door becomes sideways like that you got to make sure it's the right way so then after that you got to build two pillars up like this and then to the right block of this pillar you've got to break a block put fill in the water sorry if you can hear any background noise of my new puppy let's just quickly take off these frost walker because it seems to be freezing the water and there we go so then after that we've got to break this block here and place a piston into that block with a redstone and then block then dig down two blocks and the two blocks are long more and then one block hit through like there so it's like an L and then just one block here and what you have to do is you and then you have to get some redstone and lead it into this block and then you have to break this block here place a stone brick block on top so you can break that one afterwards and we put it into a repeater that's going into a block like that and now in theory it should work so I think I haven't gone wrong anywhere so you walk up to it and the doors open and what's happening is the as you walk up to the door these frost walker boots are freezing the water here which is setting off this bud switch which is retracting the piston along which is setting off the redstone to open the door and then after you've done all of that you can basically decorate it how you like so we can, let's just put little roof on top because I've got to show you this bit and let's just put a little box around it so let's do this just cover it up like that and then cover it all of this now when you get here if you want to replace the floor you can wait let me just see what I've done here because I've just my brain went dead then so let's just put our frost walker boots back on Let's go into here and I think I've done the floor, the piston. Nope, I did do it in the right place. So what you have to do is you have you can get a block of your choice. Any block, doesn't really matter. And you can replace the floor how you like. So you can have blocks on top of here. Like that. If you want to do that as the floor, you have to place one block here. And then place another block. So then that will retract the piston back into its original state. And then you can make this go around and suck back into your room and then after you've done that you can just fill it in with the block of your choice 
No. Nope. If this happens, there we go, you just break that block and replace it and then you can just decorate it how you like. So then let's just quickly put a box around this here. And that is how you build the thing, which is very, very cool. Now I think it's inverted somehow because if that ever happens, if it inverts, you've got to place the block back down and the door should shut. And that is how you build an automatic door. So I would like to say thank you very, very much for watching. Comment, subscribe and scratch that like button. Goodbye.